Chat, welcome back. Good to see you all here for Black Skylands. You can check this game out with the link down below in the description. And today's stream is sponsored by the makers of Black Skylands as well. So thanks to them for sponsoring. We've taken a look at this game before on our uh, channel. There was a video on it, and uh, I've kind of forgotten a lot of the game. So we'll start from scratch. But for those of you who like making yourself some big-o airships and going to war and building fleets and collecting supplies and exploring a world, well, that's what this one is all about. Oh. It's in early access, too. Greetings! Black Skylands is now in early access. We're currently solving stability and technical issues and preparing a content update. Ooh. Uh, we're grateful for any feedback from you. Help us grow and improve the game. All right. Of course. Lots of games are like that now. Oh, that's cool. Uh oh, that's not a... I'm going to guess that's not a giant kitty. <clears throat> oh, yeah. That's some pretty music. But anyway, welcome aboard. I hope you're all enjoying your week so far. I am good. I hope you are good too. Happy New Year to everybody. A lot of you off today too, by the way, because of the um, a lot of people having New Year's Day off today because yesterday was a Sunday. So yeah, makes sense. So for those of you who are off, enjoy your probably last day before starting the New Year. Check that out. She's got a big old gun on her back and she's standing on some cannons too. What I'm guessing from this image already is that there's some sort of a corruption coming in. Looks like villages are on fire and such. Love the pixelated graphics style. I'm always a fan of that. Uh, let's see. Camera just... Alternative ship control is on. Oh, you can play with the gamepad. Oh, that's why. Let me unplug my gamepad. I'll try mouse and keyboard first. And then we'll try gamepad if we want to. Cool. Uh, let's see. Controls video... All good. Animated clouds. That sounds cool. Give me that. All right, let's play. <clears throat> All right. Welcome aboard. Good morning, everybody. I hope you enjoy our first live stream of Black Skylands. Let's go. Oh, boy. What button do I hit? Uh, I'm panicking. We'll go with the first one. Whew, that was close. Sweet transition, bro. Ugh. Ooh, top down. Eva. Mom! Mom! Lauren. Dear Eva, happy birthday. Please take a seat. Breakfast is almost ready. Oh, hell yeah. Breakfast? Mom? Dad's ship is at the pier. I saw it in the spyglass. Daddy's back. He made it. I told you you'd be back in time. Oh, you're right. Your dad is in the living room, but he asked not to be disturbed, so... Dan, I'm coming. Oh, oh, is, are we going to get a stealth kill? Is that what's going on? Aw. Richard the Earner. That's the name of our dad. Daddy, you've been away for so long, like 100 years or 200. I missed you so, so much. Eva, didn't Mom tell you I'm really busy? Happy birthday. Where have you been? What did you find? Did you reach the edge of the sky? Did you see the whale fa father? Tell me everything. The whale father. Slow down. You'll find out everything later at the fair. But now, I've got a job for you. I left one box on my ship. Be a pet and run and get it. Okay. Mm, a box. Find Admiral Richard commands and Captain Eva obeys. Set sail! Oh, dude. Dad got us a birthday present. Please let it be a bag of Wendy's nugs. Let's look around before we go in. <clears throat> Dude, I love the sounds, by the way. I really appreciate games that have, like, um, this type of art style, but, like, really crisp, clean sounds. A game that kind of reminds me of this, even though it's not really like it, but it, it, it's a horror game called Darkwood, and it's basically like this, too. It's, like, straight top-down. <laughs> like the original Grand Theft Auto games, like Grand Theft Auto 1 and 2. But the sound in that game is what makes that game terrifying. So in here, to hear, yeah, people literally sweeping the floor... Just add some life to it. And lots of wind, too. Uh, Alright, Dad's ship is over. Meow. Darkwood is cool. I agree. Press right-click to shoot your hook. Oh. Is that the package? 
Take a mystery box from the ship's hold. Oh, let me scoot over a little bit. And there we go. I'm actually going to switch it to this. Oh, not that. Just make sure there's no delay. Because I'm seeing a little bit different screen. There we go. Because when I pause, it doesn't show it. Let's save. There we go. Cool. Uh, take the mystery box. Yep. What is this? Steering wheel? One of 20. A mystery box? Our inventory called warehouse? Okay. That's called a warehouse when it's in our inventory. Bring the mystery box to Richard. Shouldn't it say dad? Oh god, I died. <laughs> Wait. No. Okay. Oh, I see. Okay. Okay. Alright, good. There's a net there. That's horrible safety. OSHA's going to have a word with these people. If you fall down, it's like, nah. But if you right-click, you're cool. <laughs> Dude, dying during the tutorial. Dude, that bird is gorgeous. All right. Hi, Dad. Not now, Eva. Seriously. What do you mean, not now? You told me to go get you a package. Oh, hell yeah, Dad. Is the gun? Hell yeah, brother. Hell yeah, Dad. Wow. I'm only nine. Eva, this gift is for you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, my daughter. What is it? A pistol? Like a real pirate? You wouldn't believe how hard it was to get. Nobody else in Espaya has a pistol like that anymore. Hell yeah, Dad. You're the best ever. Can we go and play? <laughs> Can you be my, my bosun like before? Sorry, there's no time. I need to prepare for the Fair of Achievements. Meanwhile, Eva, you help me. I asked Aaron to get the berries from the cake. Berries? For the cake, but your brother's still not back. He probably got to playing with the hunters again. Go see Uncle Kane. He should know. And he can teach you how to use your pistol at the same time. God, Mom and Dad are the best. Grandpa Oswald, you came too. Of course, Granddaughter. How could I forget your birthday? Here's your gift. Oh, Grandpa, did you get me some ammunition? Amazing, a moth living, a living one. She's so sweet. Thank you, Grandpa. I think you're already old enough to have your own moth. Her name is Luma. A moth? Grandpa, Mom and Dad got me a nine. You can't at least get me like a grenade or something? Luma, you're so great. Do you want to go for a walk? Oh, that's the... Uh, to pick up an object, approach and press E. Hell yeah! I'm securing the perimeter. Alright, let's go talk to Kane. Kane the Hunter. Wait, that's Crash. What do you have there, little miss? A toy pistol? Want me to show you a real one? One that hurts people? Bruh. Crash, you're uh, frightening the girl. Get out of my sight before I get angry. I think about what you're doing. Forget my comrade, Eva. He's a fool. A sick man. Don't waste your bullets on him. Does your pistol not shoot? I think it does, but I don't know how. It's cool, though, isn't it? Dad gave it to me. Uncle Kane, teach me what to do with it. <clears throat> since when have I been the uncle? Mom told me to call you uncle now since you become the chief hunter. Well, if Lauren said so... Let's have a look. A normal pistol, just aim and pull the trigger smoothly. Try it. Shoot 15 times. Just anywhere? I'm gonna go over here. You two don't know gun safety at all. Done. Who's a beautiful bird? Who's so clever? You are my pride and joy. Look, my feathered comrade's proud of you, too. Your falcon's grown so big and graceful. Aw, oh, thanks, Eva. Joking aside, you're a born shooter. Only one eye, but a sharp one, right? Look after it. Don't want to be known as the world's first blind sniper, lol. You know, this year I set up a training camp for young fighters like you near Carpenter's Valley. Oh. I bet your camp's where Aaron flew off to. Ah, uh, your brother's... Done a runner again? Oh, right. He was so he was pestering me about the camp yesterday, so that's bad news for my boys and girls. 
Will you save them? Sure. We just need to patch up Dad's ship and go find Uncle Jim. Uh, this feels like a Nerf gun, actually. Hold shift to run. Okay. Oh, there's a bridge here. Oh, it's stairs. Oh, we're like on our... This is not like an island, but an actual ship. Like a big O engine, brother. Is that a Hemi? Tucker hat, brother, yeah. He'll shoot your eye out, kid. Yeah, exactly, chat. Exactly. Let's see. Um... Oh, dude, that's the front of the... That's sweet, man. Got a big old hood ornament. Like a ram or something. And that must be our money. We got 500 bucks. Sweet. Uh, take a repair kit from Jim. Uh, where's Jim? Yeah, shoot him a Gavin. That's right. Uh, uh, uh. Hey, Jim. <clears throat> Jim the engineer. Happy birthday, Eva. But what's your daddy like, huh? Vanishes for nearly a year, gets everyone worried, and then comes back for the fair in the nick of time. Elsie. Hi, Eva. What's the pis What's that, a pistol? Seriously, let me have a look. I don't know what Richard brought back this time, but how his eyes are burning, I get the feeling... Uznians? Uznians? Won't be able to compete without uh, with our fair this year. Uncle Jim, maybe you could take me to the hunter's camp. Dad let me take his ship. Though it does need repairs. Of course. Let me f finish work. Come back a bit later. Eva, let me disassemble your pistol. I'll put it back together, promise. Elsie, girl, maybe you should give me the repair kit. I'd fix the ship myself and get flying. What do you say? Are you kidding, Eva? Dad will be furious. <clears throat> For a while, then he'll forget about it. Come on. What's life without adventures? I'll fly there and straight back. Nobody will even notice. Uh, well, all right. Just don't tell Dad here. Uh, can you run the game on Android? You know, honestly, I'm not sure if this is on anything but PC at the moment since it's early access. But it is possible that it could be on, like, PlayStation, Xbox, maybe maybe mobile? It's possible. So, um, But I don't have, like, an Xbox or an Android. So just check the appropriate stores for Black Skylands, and you should be able to see if it's there. Otherwise, the link in the description should link to it, too. I like the art style a lot. Cool. Let's go into the bar, uh, in the inventory. So warehouse is like our inventory, but it's not on us. It's like the bigger ship's inventory, the island. Hold E to repair the sky ship. Oh, not the cops. Talk to Elsie. Wait, what is this? Oh, it's a cannon. Oh, there you are. <laughs> What's up? <clears throat> I'll fly to look for Aaron at Borvin's Sawmill. Mom said she'd flown there. I hope she's alright. Ship's probably not fueled, so drop by the fuel station on your way. Alright, thanks, girl. Oh, we're leaving. Hell yeah, we're taking the ship. All right, let's get it started. Come on, Dad. There we go. All right, uh, ship hold capacity, ship ammunition and hold, repair kits in the hold, health, fuel, energy. I wonder what energy is for. Ammunition... Capacity, okay. Got it. Oh, right. Doesn't it follow the mouse or something? How the... Oh, I see. Okay. I gotcha. I see how it works. So we aim with the mouse, and then, like, we kind of steer, like, with a rudder. It's like a boat. Buy a canister. Uh, 
Uh, oh. A canister for storing and transporting fuel. Explosive. Fill the canister. Oh, we have to buy the canister, then fuel it up? Don't double charge me. Dude, is fuel free, but the canisters we gotta pay for? Alright, so we'll have some fuel left over. Cool. Talk to Fang. Dude, I love the skybox below us. That's really cool. Yeah, Jerry Bananas can. What's up, Tucker? How you doing? Is this a storyline game? Uh, I mean, so far. Are those mines? Oh, dude, look at our brake. It actually, like, deploys uh, air brakes. That's cool. I think it's just setting up the world and the lore, but eventually it could be open world. We'll have to we'll have to see. We will find out. What is that? Money. Ammo? Wow. Don't fall into that. Hi, Fang. Another young earner who's come to show off their abilities. Nobody's been able to beat my record yet. Your obnoxious brother is here, too. He tried to pass the test incognito. That little, um, got into a box and almost made it to the end of the test. But the kid was too big, and he got stuck in the box. We didn't bother to pull him out. Once you've done the test, take him back with you to Father's ship. The engineers there can work out how to get him out of the box. Your test begins. Use all your skills, Eva. But you're not, you're still not going to beat me. Find Aaron. Oh, if I right-click, I can collect those. Okay, let me go get that other box. Hidden money everywhere. Yep. Let's get that money. Nice. Alright. Gotta pay off that fuel bill somehow. To reach farther, roll off the ground and then use the hook. Oh, sweet. Is that an enemy? Tango down. Gather. Uh, increases health regeneration for one minute, 30 seconds. Oh. So we get a little health boost. <laughs> F for melee attacks. Aaron, Eva, Eva, I'm here in the box. I almost made it to the end of the test. I was invisible and unstoppable. True. I did not, I did get stuck in this box. <laughs> Can you take me to Uncle Jim, the head of engineers? He'll work out how to get me out of here. My legs are going numb. Hold on. Got him. Well, now I want to break everything because it could have money. Yep. Dude, every box is going to have money. All right, you you wait here. Har Harvest Aaron. Carry Aaron. You wait there, Aaron.
Dude, back at the main camp, there's got to be so much money from breaking boxes available. All that money, all that loot. <sighs> Frip. Frip the swip. Alright, switch flipped. You wait there, Aaron. There's money everywhere. Well, it's not like he's going to go anywhere. He's stuck in a box. Oh, here we go. I don't know. All that loot. All that loot. This is like you're fighting with noob AI. Yeah, it's you know, a little tutorial, I guess, for how to use the gun and how to melee in combat. You can dodge with the roll, so that's cool. Tutorial taught us that, so that's good. Let's go, bruh. There he is. Talk to Fang. Is that blood? Did young Erner decide to become one of us? Hmm. Just paint. How disappointing. Did you find your brother? Shove him in the hold and fly home. It's time for real professionals to train. Alright, Aaron. We're going home. Return to the father ship. Not the mothership. That's for aliens. Q is some sort of shield? Or like a... Like a burst? Moving resources. You can move resources between the skyship's hold and a warehouse through the interface if your skyship is close to a warehouse. Yeah, sorry, Dad. I'm nine, so I don't know how to park yet. I guess we'll keep the fuel on board. Hi, Dad. Oh, it's Jim. Aaron! How did you even get in there? Hello, Uncle Jim. People tend to underestimate boxes. What are you, a cat? <laughs> As the head of the engineers, you must understand that. Just imagine how many people you could just carry in boxes at once. You'll see, when I grow up, that's how everyone will travel. Well, if you fly American Airlines, yeah. Oh, you're a funny kid, Aaron. All right, let's get you out of there. We'll grease up uh, you up with motor oil and you'll pop out like a cork. Close your eyes and mouth. Why not just break the box? Don't we have crowbars? Yeah, they look like flying stingrays, yeah. Like all these little bird creatures. Alright, so now that we can know... Oh, there's so much money. I hope we get to keep all this cash. I want to break everything. Okay. I like the music here. So that's the quote unquote warehouse, okay. Dude, there could be like at least 200 bucks here. Seems worth it to break everything. There's stuff under the tents? Bruh. Bruh. That's a chair. I wonder if I can break stuff on other people's ships. A newspaper. I'm glad mom and dad are cool with me just walking around stealing. That's fine. Giving their kid a gun and stealing. Ah, to be fair, this world's filled with pirates, so. Gotta learn to shoot someday. Hey, what's up, Ashley? Welcome to the stream. Oh, that's somebody like reading a book. Box. I'm probably going to miss some. There's stuff all over this place. It's hard to tell what's a chair, what's a wagon, and what's a box. 
I guess that's everything. Yeah, we'll call it good. 99 out of 100. There's one there. Never mind, there's more. Are those blueberries? Chat. Oh, there's even money in the blueberries. Uh, aiming the gun's a little different. Like, when we shoot, it gives us kind of like a weird bracket thing. But I think this cursor is just to show you which way you're, like, facing. But those can be, like, adjusted in controls. What is this? Alchemy? It's like an evil-looking octopus. That's cool. We got like over 500 bucks. I think that's good enough. Is that grandma? No, that's mom. That's grandma. Richard the Earner. Sweetie, you're just in time. I want to show you the heads of the factions of... Oh, I want to show the heads of the factions my discovery, or do you want to walk around some more till everyone gets here? Oh, they, they literally tell you, like, hey, do you want to go gather all this money? I'm good. I want to run now. No, I walked enough. Dad, what did Uncle Richard bring? I can't wait to have a look. Elsie, stay with me. Enough of doing your own thing. Commander Eldon. Ring? The ring? Oh, damn. Wow, I didn't realize another game had a cameo. Uh, everything's clear. You can begin. Ruth the Scientist. Oh, she's the one with the octopus. She's got that book. That was her lab. Dude, this music is dank. At last. Uh, my dear friends, any discovery requires long searching and sacrifice, but earners are ready for that. We live for tomorrow. The average person will find it difficult to accept what you're about to see. Up till now, you've been living a blissful ignorance, but it's time to say farewell. Huh. Blissful ignorance? It'll be even more blissful to see the miserable faces of the guys from the Unzia when we show them Espaya's new, a great new discovery. I'm more interested in science than politics. May we now examine the object? How impatient you are. Well then, welcome to the future. Uh oh. Bro, you let that thing go in your house? Where did you dig up that monstrosity? Is it dangerous? Yeah, I'd imagine so. It's a sample of the swarm. That's what I've named the species of animal that lives in the eternal storm. For a long time, those lands were hidden from us. But I and my team were able to penetrate into the swarm and discovered there is an extraordinary ecosystem before you as one of the inhabitants. We gave it the name Linger. No doubt his appearance frightens you, but this is a peaceful, peace, peaceable creature. And furthermore, he's under the influence of a tranquilizer. That's peaceful? No way. You can only get claws like that on a predator. Trust a hunter's instinct. Elsie, get behind me. I have personally seen how Linger eats the grasses of the eternal storm, samples of which I brought with me. He's no carnivore, and not aggressive. Well, that remains to be seen. I can't wait till the two of us get started on our experiments together. Let me get a closer look at you. It's gonna attack. It's gonna attack. Are you crazy? Keep away from it. My gut tells me the creature is dangerous. Ma'am? Come on, Uncle Kane. A funny little thing like that. <laughs> eh. 
Aaron. Oh, it's Aaron. Die, monster. So anyway, I just started blasting. Oh, damn! Friendly fire, bro. Seven years later. Yo. Is this Terminator music? That escalated quickly. Uh, wow. Are these coffins? Oh, what? Oh, she's all grown up now. Wait, her eye is better. I think that's the last coffin today. Oh, it's not, maybe not not her parents. Oh, there's lots of people dying. What the hell's going on? There's the whale clan. Our logo's a whale, but we have like a giant ram as our logo. Clear debris. Oh, we can customize the ship and stuff now. Now that it's been destroyed, we can rebuild. I don't know who did what, though. Replenish ammo. Um... I think we should clear all this debris. Because we're going to fix up the ship. So we can actually customize this, uh, this ship that way. Yeah, maybe she was wearing the eye patch for, like, fun. Clear all this debris. We're going to build stuff eventually. So I guess we're going to build houses for people or maybe like factories or something. Refinery. It's taken a while. Pirates were pretty smart to be TBH. I agree. Lots of cool pirate technology. There's like a hammer on the ground. Hammer time. Bum, bum.
take a look and see what else is around. More loot. Pirates actually built the first Hadron Collider, but lost the treasure map they used to find it. True. That's so true. Okay, I think we got everything. Carry street lamp. Oh, what? Oh, yeah, okay, so we can place stuff wherever we want. Sweet. Ah, so we can customize the whole ship. Very nice. Is the ship flying or floating on water or sky? Well, I guess we're floating right now because there's giant, like, you know, like, airbags and stuff around, but there's also, like, big air engines, so... We float, but we can also fly. Like, to propel us forward. It's like an airship. Like a dirigible, a zeppelin, a blimp. That kind of thing. A war blimp. A war zeppelin. Alright, let's go figure out what's going on over here. Wait. Dad, the coffins are ready. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Today we lost many people. Parents, friends, children for seven years. Now we've had darkness without end. But that's no reason to give up. Oh, we must have got attacked again for everybody to be dead so suddenly. I guess we keep rebuilding and getting attacked. We continue to fight for our fallen comrades and for the future generations of Aspia. The sky is always hungry. The sky is always hungry. The sky is always hungry. Oh, wow. I'm becoming the master of funeral addresses. I'm so tired of losing people. As if we don't have enough trouble from the swarm. Now Kane's falcons have gone crazy. Things will get better soon. I think you better rest. Today was a long day. Probably. Hey, Kane. Uh, uh, Kane's falcons are flying this way. They want to finish what they started. Quick, hide the children in the hold and grab arms. Kane? He was cool before. Don't panic, I won't let f the Falcons do anything. Dude, Kane, what happened? You used to be cool. Oh, wow. He's got a serious ship. Please accept my condolences. I'm sorry that there was a misunderstanding between Kane's Falcons and the Earners. A misunderstanding? Your little militia fired on the father ship with the howitzer you swore you'd use against the swarm. People died. That's why I flew here. I want to apologize. I didn't want those deaths any more than you did, Richard. I'm a keeper of order, not a killer. We've just sent a dozen coffins on their final journey. What are you after that if not a killer? I unfortunately sometimes... My lieutenants let me down. There are times when they don't follow orders. But I swear to the residents of Aspaya that I won't I won't allow any more I indiscipline. Is that a word? I think they mean like insubordination. Uh, Lieutenant Mort, what do you have to say for yourself? Mort must say sorry for playing with Erner's ship. Mort promises he won't do it again. Is this Mad Max in the sky all of a sudden? Good boy, Mort. 
And to make sure you don't forget your promise, three dozen lashes await you back at Kane's Fort. No, please, no. Take him away. Now, let's talk about you, Richard. I know about your plans to go to the Eternal Storm, and I'm here to prevent you. Stop. Are you saying we should wait until those monsters swallow us, up, swallow us up? Not me. In the swarm, I'll find something to use against the swarm. I have to go there as soon as possible. You don't change, Erner. You spit on all of us. You act like a hero, but you're just making it harder for me to defend the people of Aspaya. Remember, Richard, I'm following your every move, and I'll destroy the father's ship before I let you run away. My family always thought of you as one of our own, and this is how you thank us? You've taken me and my children hostage. Your children are safe. I give my word as a falcon. I wish no harm on Eva or Aaron. I'm just preventing you from making mistakes. Mistakes? It'll be a mistake for all of us to back into a corner, like pathetic animals, and devour each other while we wait for death. So, you think I'm pathetic? Well then. Kane, what a lovely surprise. I didn't expect you so early in the morning. Now that you're here, will you help me prepare for Eva's birthday? Oh, our birthday again. I can't believe my little girl's already 11. How time flies. Oh, what? We weren't nine. We were even younger than that. Lauren, snap out of it. Your daughter's 18 now. Oh. I sent Eva to look for Aaron. That rascal's just slipped through the clouds again. Please, Kane. Help Eva if she comes to you. Fly over here more often. It's always a pleasure to have a cup of tea with you. I cer certainly miss Mills. I'd be delighted. Richard, I hope you've understood one another. I'm leaving Lieutenant Crash here with you, just in case you happen to forget what I've said. Kane is a pain. Damn, that dude's got a battleship. Lauren refuses to see Kane's weak, uh, wickedness. Eva, something's broken your mother, and it won't go back in place, but it's not forever. So many years have passed already. Time alone isn't enough to heal some wounds, my daughter. Oh, Eva, I almost forgot. Grandpa Oswald was looking for you. The old man is still hoping to teach somebody uh, from the family how to grow a crop. Oh, we're going to start farming now? All right, here we go. Now we're into the base building. Cool. Bum, bum, ba, bum, bum, ba, bum. I want to look around some more. Any boxes? Oh, we could actually like sit down. Can I repair these? Oh, you can. I need scrap met. Metal, okay. Yeah, the ship has absolutely been destroyed. Um... Let's chat. Grandpa, Dad said that you wanted to see me. Oh, my granddaughter. That I did. Your father was absolutely useless on the farm. He always ran away from home when he was, when it was sowing time. That's the earner he is. We must think not only of the dead. The living people need feeding. We are the earners, Eva. Don't forget that. I'm leaving. The earners need me at the moth nest. It's hard for everyone now. What do we do to deserve this? I understand, Grandpa. I think I'll manage. I used to like picking cabbage when I was small. I'll leave my books on cultivation to you, and you'll quickly learn everything from them, and now it's time I left. I hope to see you again soon. No. Nah. Okay. Go to the blackboard by the cleared construction site and build a garden. Anywhere? Ooh, 
Where would a garden be nice? Uh, let's build it over here. Clear debris. Garden. So we can also build an armory, a factory, a ship workshop, and a bar. <laughs> Hell yeah, brother. Nice. So it takes two wood and two stone. Oh, that's cool. Oh, we planted cabbage. Base building, farming, crafting, survival. Confirmed. Luma, did you manage it? Did you find Aaron? You've been away for ages. I'm so happy to see you. Messenger moth. In her legs, Luma holds a rectangular device with a note stuck to it. Eva, it's Aaron. I don't want to celebrate too early, but I think I found a way to get rid of the swarm. But first, I need to show you something. Fly to Mills Island. This is important. In the tablet that... Luma's bought, uh, brought you, there's a map that'll help you navigate. Don't say a word to Father. Thank you, Luma. Oh, Aaron, what's this all about? Activate your tablet and look at the map. Oh, cool. Uh, before you fly to the island, compare your power with the power of the island. If your power is less than that of your enemies, a skull icon will appear above their head. Such enemies will be extremely difficult to defeat without raising your power. Okay, so it's like a level. Your equipment power, your ship power. Oh, damn. Swarm region. There is a lot of stuff. Oh, we can fast travel. Cool. Journal. Equipment. Ooh, we get several different guns. Cool. So we can equip several different guns. Looks like they have different ammo types, like shotgun, pistol, machine gun. Ah, oh, we get different ships, too. And or weapons. Oh, we can upgrade our smaller ships. So we can upgrade our main ship and smaller ships. That's pretty cool. Yeah, the pirates have better technology, yep. Rescued population. Oh, is this Ixion now? It's cool, she's got a compass on her uh, glove. Get to the fuel station. Well, we know that's pretty safe. Let's go. Oh, now the world's different. It's all, like, destroyed. There's not, like, any more ships trading. Talk to Elsie. Hi. Red, you look awful. I thought her name was, uh, Elsie. Eva, you... Oh, maybe they call her Red because of her hair. Evie, you heard what Kane said about the swarm. There's been no news from the east for ages. That means Commander Eldon's forces aren't coping with the onslaught of the swarm. I don't know how long I'll stay. I need to make sure Dad's safe. Maybe we can help in some way. Elsie, calm down. Breathe. Everything's going to be okay. I understand completely if this was... If I was in your shoes, I'd have headed home at full steam long ago. But now it's too dangerous. Kane will be watching... The father ship carefully for the next few days. Wait till everything settles down or until Aaron gets back. Do you think he's actually coming back? There's been no word from him for a year and a half. Oh, he'll be back soon, trust me. Very well. If you're so certain, I'll stay a couple more days. Oh, yes, I completely forgot. Richard asked me to give this to you. I kept it specifically for you. Here, these are dangerous times, so it's better not to leave the father ship without a weapon. Hell yeah. An oh, more guns. Actual pistol. And an assault rifle. Hell yeah! Alright, you have three weapons equipped. You can have a three weapon 
uh, three weapons equipped at a time. To switch to one of them, open the equipment page in your tablet. Select the weapon slot you wish to change and select the new weapon. Cool. Oh, the pistol's got infinite ammo. The assault rifle does not. Looks like there's also limited range. Dude, the animations are really cool. It actually takes her time to pull out the new weapon, too. Okay. Hi there. Victor Stoner. How can I help you? Uh, I wanted to say hi. I'd like to buy something. Uh, repair kit. Yeah, it's probably a good idea to buy one of those. Oh, we bought eight of them. And let's buy fuel. We gotta fill up the fuel ourselves. Buy the cannon ammo. Ship ammo. Only 15? I'm gonna buy 30. Oh, there's like a day night cycle. It's getting darker. Cool. Oh, it's automatically transferred to the ship's hold. That's cool. Alright, let's get to the island. Cannon blast right click. Nose cannon left click boost l shift. Impulse shield Q. Look around with space. Ooh. That's Bob Ross right there. Chat, you having a good time? One of the chatter, you're having a good time. Is that money? Yeah. Nope. Oh. More money. Are you having a good time, chat? Looks like you're having a good time. That's good, chat. That makes me happy. Go fishing. I guess we'll need like a fishing pole. Can I shoot the fiery rocks for resources? Uh, good question, actually. Oh, what is that? Oh, there's some wood there. That's awesome. We can find tons of uh, resources that way. Is this like sh ship abandoned? Oh, there's like debris down there. We can also fish for debris. Aerial battle. To shoot the weapons at the bow of the ship, hold left click. Hold right to aim the side cannons, then release to launch a volley. Oh boy. Get wrecked. Liberate all three islands from the Falcons. Let's go fight more of these dudes.
<laughs> Dude, the cannons are awesome. I love that. Reloading. Missile. Oh boy. Maybe that'll destroy it. That was cool, man. Yeah, that's pretty close. Yeah, maybe one more. That's good enough. That'll buff out. Ship combat? Actually cool. Now let's try the ground combat. wonder if I can use the grappling to pull somebody close to me. Oh yeah, you can. Carry explosive barrel. I don't know if I want that on my ship. Yeah, it's like GTA 1, yeah. I like how we have to bring resources back to our ship. That's cool. Means we can clear an area and then just stack up a bunch of stuff on the dock. Uh, put a resource into the warehouse. You can pick it up from any other warehouse. Oh. That's the way around that. Floristic, thanks for the one year as a raptor egg. Congratulations. Thank you for your support. Carry wooden table. New member, welcome. Wait, can I actually put this in the hold? Like, can I steal furniture from other islands and put it on our own ship? That's cool. No way, we can. <laughs> you get GTA furniture and like stuff. Wait, what's this? Alright, I'll just I'm gonna take this, whatever this is. Okay. So if I put stuff in there, I still have to go back to there to get it. I don't think that'll go to the ship, I think. Oh, that's for healing. Cool. Dude, I can decorate with all the plants and stuff? Alright, so some of those are like for decorations. Some of those probably serve a purpose. I wonder if it's like, when we get to building houses and stuff, I wonder if we decorate them, it makes people happier or something. Read. Uh, I can't. Won't let me. Maybe we have to kill the enemies first. Oh, yeah. Free turret. Yeah, Happy New Year's, guys. If you missed the last couple of streams, I hope you've been having some cool holidays. A blueberry bush. Alright, I'm not going to steal everything. I just didn't know you could do it. Oh, I can transfer to ship's hold here. Okay. So if there's something I don't want, I can just drop it. Okay. 
So you can put stuff in there and then transfer it to ship automatically. If you hit a button. Get wrecked. Chats in the blueberry bush. Anything else? <laughs> I like how I can carry street lights and stuff. I mean, I guess we could put it in the... Oh, now we have a light. I guess we could put it in the warehouse. And it won't take up any space on our little ship. We can cannibalize entire islands. Alright. Uh, hold C near a crate. Luma will move it to your ship's hold. Luma can deliver a crate to a crammed hold. Can't deliver a crate. Okay. So, like, try this. Ah. Alright, so I can do it... I can do it manually to the warehouse or automatically to the ship, but we have to empty the ship's hold. Cool. What's up, bruh? Is that a boss? Yep. Full, uh, no. Oh, I see. It's like a health kit that we can use. Alright, let's try our rifle. treasure oh full loot goblin baby uh in any town or village you'll definitely find someone who will exchange gold for something useful i wonder who left it here i think i see a note page from diary 14th march 141 it's very sad and scary to be leaving one's own town we're literally being evicted from our own island but i agree with hector i'm not ready to submit those espions uh, and become an earner. We're sky wolves. And the day will come when we, the Asparians, the asparagus, regret the day they banished us. Cool. Well, that's the scrap metal. More enemies. There's no more enemies here. The island can now be considered defended. Cool. Happy New Year's! Island Liberation Reward. You increase the population by liberating islands. The island population is shown on the map using population. You can activate various improvements for Eva and her ship. Improvements are activated in the armory and the ship workshop.
Sweet. It's our territory now. Where's Aaron? All that's here is a note and some kind of diary. Sister, if you're reading this, then you've managed to get to where you need to be. I found our father's diary. Read it. Diary of Richard Mills. It's all my fault. Why did I bring that creature here? Although the storm would probably have reached Espaya one way or another. I'm not sure... I'm not one for our gardens, mines, or sawmills. I've always wanted to discover something new. Can't stop thinking about the eternal storm. I need to go back there. We need to go back there. Eva, Aaron, Lauren, we'll all head there and find a way to turn the storm back. Or we'll all die uh, on that on the way. Uh, <clears throat> then at least I'll be remembered as a hero and not one who spoiled everything. I hear footsteps. Someone's coming in the house. Aaron? Oh, damn. It's Crash. Hey, little miss. What did Kane tell you? To sit at home and not go anywhere. Do you think Crash wouldn't notice? That crash wouldn't follow. Go on and get yourself on the ship. Bro, you want to fight? Stealth takedown. Alright, what should we leave behind? I don't know, the table and bed could go in houses if we build them. We'll decorate with this stuff later. Cool. Return to the father ship. Yeah, it crashes like cyborg or something. He's like Adam Smasher from Cyberpunk. I see there's wood over here. Wait, that's where we went before. Oh, so this is like a fog of war until we get close. Wing Island, Carpenter's Valley. Big Water Island. So we're supposed to uh, liberate all these islands eventually. From somebody different people. Seems important to have building material. So you can gather from islands, street lights, and people? Yeah. Street lights, people. I saw there was money here. Cool, let's go back. I like the combat. I really do. You're only looting the essentials, right? Well, I'm looting what I think will be building materials. I left, like... I guess we have a warehouse inventory that goes between all the warehouses up to a thousand. We can put it on our ship to bring it back to our main ship. Wait, there's like a little ex... Exclamation. New request. Oh, there's side objectives. Cool. Also, I don't know what this, like... I don't know what this is. Maybe these are areas we can move our main ship, like along this... 
arrow line. Where are we flying? Uh, we're flying back to our main base. Which uh, has been a, a little... It's seen better days. What a catastrophe. All's lost. Rupert, where's the amplifier? Ron. Curses, Rupert. Quit stuffing bananas in your mouth. Where did you put the fire extinguisher? I have a fire extinguisher you can use. A repair kit, too. Are you? Can you talk? Of course. Rupert is a mute as a stinking fish, but I have perfect speech capabilities. Well, you've never seen a talking ape? Oh my god, it's Planet of the Apes. They blew it up! Uh... I've never seen an ape before at all. Never mind a talking one. Poor girl, Rupert and I are unique. Our minds were swapped in a disastrous experiment. I've been attempting to repeat the trick ever since with no success. Well, are we going to sit around or can we repair the ship already? Of course, let me just run to the hold. Done. I still don't understand how you managed to wreak such, wreak such havoc on the ship. The emergency transponder burned up when we increased the voltage to... Well, don't worry, worry your he little head, girl. My name isn't girl. It's Eva. Ah, yes. I neglected to introduce myself. I am Ron. I specialized in researching artifacts from ancient civilizations, and the gorilla in a human body is Rupert. Uh, do you know where... Anywhere where we could stay for a little while and replenish our supplies? You're in luck. Father's ship is dead ahead. Anyone who respects other people's lives and the safety of the ship is welcome there. Don't worry, girl. I promise to observe safety precautions occasionally. Oh, dude. Does that mean he's going to, like, come to our ship and we can buy stuff? That's cool. I don't think it actually cost us anything to do that. Oh, so there's ten people living there. I guess they live there, but you can't see them? I wish we could customize the islands, like... Like the little island villages. That'd be cool. Maybe we can eventually. Oh, cool. So now he's pulled up. So now we can probably get uh, side jobs from him. All right, let's see. Wood. Ammo, canister, repair kits. I think the turret can be used here at the main base. Oh, anything in the warehouse will actually go to the main ship, too. Okay. So we can just put everything in the warehouse. Unless we want it on the ship. Let's talk to these guys first. I see you've gotten settled on the father ship. Oh, there's a wonderful lamp here, and the people are nicer than in Sign Town. I have a proposal for you, girl. I need some materials for my research. An ancient civilization left behind some artifacts, crystals that hold the secrets of long-lost technology. Some of them can be found in the Wing Islands. Why don't you get them yourself? Rupert's are afraid of heights. He acts nervous and clumsy when he flies, and the experiments require concentration. The crystals are difficult to retrieve, as they're hidden inside a complex structure, but I promise that studying them will benefit both of us. Fine, I'll look for them. Hope <laughs> you won't blow up the father ship when I'm gone. Alright, so we gotta go to that island we saw before. Unknown signal. Dude, the music here is nice, man. Oh, looks like the, uh... I don't know if I should repair the floor. Scrap metal seems kind of rare, but... Eh, let's do it. Why not? It'll make walking around a little less of a pain in the neck. 
I guess that'll be our goal anyway, is to eventually get the ship 100%. Cabbages. Oh, we have no more seeds. Oh, we can buy some. Cotton, flax, or cabbage? Uh, let's do flax. Cool. Oh, they'll be ready in 10 minutes. Alright, talk to... This lady. Eva, I need your help. Uncle Richard asked me to build an armory, but I can't manage it on my own. Our supplies ran out long ago. If we want to defend ourselves against the swarm, we need arms. Chat's got plenty of arms. Uh, find resources. One scrap... Uh, one stone, one wood, one scrap metal. Alright, so we need scrap metal to build, too. Oh, we can go back to... Alright, let's do that. We'll go to this island, stop and get what we need, and then we'll go to Wing Island and come back. Cool. Wait. I guess we'll stop on the way and get fuel too. Oh. Yeah, we can fast travel. If we do that though, we don't get these boxes. It's like, if we fast travel, we don't get to hit all the boxes with money. And it might take fuel to fast travel too, I'm not sure. And I don't want to get stuck without fuel. So I'm assuming we can upgrade this boat. I'm assuming we can upgrade the big O ship. All of our guns. Both like our handheld weapons, guns on this little ship, and then also the big O ship. I wonder if there's ways for fuel efficiency too. Like make our ship faster, more fuel efficient. Increase its health. Increase damage to falcons for a minute and 30 seconds. Cool. Uh, well, I spent the scrap to repair the ship. I guess I shouldn't have done that. We have the wood and stone, but that's fine. We gotta repair the ship anyway. And upgrade it. So we gotta do both eventually. And eh, maybe we'll find some on the side quest. Sounds like there's people here on this island, but I want to be able to like fix up the bridges and customize their houses and let them move in. <clears throat> be kind of cool too if like they would pay a tax or something. Like if you fix up their houses and made them all nice, that they would like 
pay you a little bit. Or something? I don't know. Well, let's do that secondary objective. You like this game? What's up, Nerdpalooza? Yeah, this game's cool so far. We we did take a brief first look at it before. It's changed a little bit. I like it so far. Um, that looks sus. It's like a giant something. Like a smelter or something? Uh-oh. Get wrecked. Got him. Michael, thanks for the 21 months as an egg. I like when they fly over. That's nice. turret there. I wonder if we have to destroy those to take over the island. Can he shoot at me? No. Uh. Oh, that's assault ammo. Cool. Despawn. Okay. It's a shame we can't take ammo and like store it on our boat. Exclamation point game. I could switch to this gun. Rudolph Note 1. Uh, 18 February 141. Not so long ago, Aspia split into factions yesterday at the Aspia Council of uh, commune, Communes? Communes? Uh, the deci the mm, Sorry, the Decision was finally taken to unite all communes of Aspy into four factions. As the leader of our commune, Hector voted against this, but now we have literally been left with no choice. We must choose who 
to be earners, hunters, artisans, or historians. Huh. I can't jump there? Okay. Huh. A mod box? Return to father's ship with mod box. Ooh. That must be something for the main ship. Cabbage seeds. Dude, that little moth is so helpful. Morgan! Morgan, you have a little uh, leaf in your hair there. Please be quieter. There's still enemies nearby. Liberate this island and we can talk. Almost. Ammo drops after melee kills. When you finish an enemy with a melee attack, you get an ammo clip. Oh. Oh. That's cool. He dead to death, Buford T. Gamer. Hope you're doing good, Bradford. Thanks for sending a picture of the control tower yesterday, dude. That was sweet. Hope you're well. Happy New Year. You the best, Bradford. You the best. So it might be a good idea to destroy these towers with a melee kill, too. Maybe they drop ammo all the time, but like if not, you just hit them like that. I hope there's a mod to carry more ammo. 90's not a lot of ammo. That's a big, big turret right there. Bro, these guys get satellite dish? Uh, we need to go to the other island. Okay, is there like a tunnel I can walk through? Oh, here. I don't think I could jump on those, though. Oh, I can. Good. Maxima, thanks for the 17 months as a raptor egg. Whoa, that's not good. Oh, get wrecked. Oh, the explode. Turrets explode, okay. And cause damage, I mean. What is this thing? That other guy's probably going to tell me about it. Use. Oh, is this the Wheel of Fortune? The code is square, circle, triangle. 
Okay. Uh, I just don't know which one's connected to which. First try. Carry energy crystal. Talk to Ron on the father ship. Oh, that's what he wanted. Okay. Right, let's chat with this other guy. This game's cool, dude. I remember first playing this and thinking like, oh, that's that's cool. But I didn't know there was all this exploration and stuff. I thought it would just be more of a... Um, I don't know. I didn't know there would be all this crafting and like that there was a whole map to explore. At least I don't remember it. Maybe I remember it at the time. Is that a muffin? There's still enemies nearby. Oh, really? Oh, my bad. Looks like there's some enemies up here. Uh, hope I can reach that. Hey, bro. Oh, we gotta find these little X's mark the spot for treasure. If you see an X chat, you gotta tell me. Uh, Rudolph Note 2, 29th of February, 141. Hector took the decision and majority agreed. Uh, the dissenters will leave our commune of Aspian wolves. We will not be earners, nor historians, or anyone else. We will live as we have always done. Let's see what the newfangled Council of Aspia has to say to that. Oh, there's some big old bird eggs in there. Final boss is to make an omelet. Drops ammo regardless. Big bird nest. Some people can summon animals. Maybe I'll learn it some day too. Ooh. So there might be a way for us to get like a companion to help us in the sky. What's up, Pipe Master? That'll be, um... First, it'll be the Goof Troop. And then if there's extra available slots, then it's um, members only. I'll have to talk to the guys to see what we're going to do. Or if everybody's available. That's kind of just a... 90% chance. Where is the, uh... Way to get across there. It's got to be north of that guy's house. Okay, I need something to extend this grappling hook. I can never make these jumps. Well, I guess I could go back to my ship and just fly to that island. But yeah, there'll probably be room. We've never done like a full thing before. We'll see. I'm going to fly to the north. I wonder if the wind direction speeds up our ship at all. 
I feel like it does. Efforts to understand the conflict between Aspaya and Uzinia have become so protracted that a group of historians decided to rename themselves scientists. Now they spend their time trying to decide the difference between a scientist and a historian. Okay. Oh, there's tons of enemies here. Let's try this. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. You can literally just roll up with the cannon and broadside. Hell yeah. Game of the year. That's super cool. Love that you can do that. Look at the blood, too. That was sweet. We'll just pull up with the big guns. There's no more enemies here. The island can be considered defended. Sweet. Another seven people live here. Standing in the fire hurts you. All right, now we can talk with that guy. Oh, this island's animated. They're like picking berries and stuff. Wait, there's something up there. Sounds good, Pipe Master. Redcoat Viking, you just sent a link to this of this game to your wife. She loves games with this kind of art style. Yeah, I like it too. The skybox is really pretty. Like you can see the sun kind of shining up here in the corner. It's it's really nice. Oh, I need to get in there somehow. How do I get in there? Maybe this guy will tell me. It looks like it's hidden. Is there any way in there? At last, there's some hope for Espaya. Thank you, Eva. Wing Island is now uh, maybe small, but it's only here that earners can grow for feed for moths. I think it's because of the calcium-rich soil. Now, it's probably not the best time to ask for your help, but I must. It's my daughter, Iris. Those guys took her to Big Water Island. She's still so small, so clueless, I don't know what they need her for. Please find her. I'll give you something for your pains. Okay. Quest leads to a quest. I don't see any way in there. Ooh, crystal. Maybe we have to unlock an ability. You might be right. There might be... 
I don't think I could just shoot the wall. Maybe that summon ability. Oh, the bird nest might be related. Maybe we can get a bird to transport us from one nest to another. And then there's a bunch of stuff in there. That might be what it is. Will I get scrap metal if I destroy the abandoned ships? Uh, I'm not sure. I think they're there so that way you can grapple to them. But there's a fuel thingy over here, so... You know what's funny? I played so much Microsoft Flight Simulator that the engine for our current ship sounds familiar. Does this guy sell ammo too? Oh yeah, for the main ship, yeah. Sup, bruh? Sup, bruh? I would like to buy... bunch of stuff. Thank you. Alright, time to refuel. Yeah, I love art style like this too, honestly. Uh, this game fits in like the whole Stardew Valley and Terraria and all that stuff. Like, it looks looks different, but it's in the same same vibe. When you played so many games, you realize all the sound files are the same. That or I'm just super, like, observant or something. Okay, who wants us to go there? I think I want to go back, though, and see what the scientist might give us from that crystal. Maybe we'll get something good. Let's go back home. The clouds are gorgeous. Absolutely beautiful. We didn't get any scrap for that lady, though. Let's let's try shooting a ship. I don't think we can. Oh. Oh, that's cool. We could shoot the asteroids and just, like, go through them. Or whatever they are. We might be able to upgrade our sky ship now. Uh, wait. She still wants us to find scrap metal. And it tells me to go here. But I kind of like already spent my scrap metal on like repairs. Which is fine, I guess, because we're going to have to repair the ship regardless. But how do I get more?
Well, I guess maybe we can get scrapped by engaging an enemy ship. I see there's enemies nearby, so let's try that. Because we are supposed to repair those holes eventually so we can get our ship repaired. So, like, everything we're doing is to repair the ship. Like, all those buildings were destroyed. There's holes in the floor. It's in, it's in bad shape, so... Let's take on these guys. Is this sponsored? Yes, it is. This is a sponsored stream. Did I get any scrap from that? Nah, darn. What's a VR? Thanks for the live, the game looks great. Yeah, I do like the art style. And I do like the fact that we can gather stuff and actually build the big ship and also modify the small ship. Okay, I guess we're gonna have to find scrap somewhere else because I didn't know the next quest would require it, but like I mentioned, we need more of that scrap anyway. Maybe we can buy some from somebody. Place a mod box on the opening station. Yeah, there's also those holes that we could dig up, like where we found treasure. That that might be where... Maybe there's one on that island that it's telling me to go to. Maybe there's another one to dig up. We'll find it out. I'm not in a rush. Leave helm or fly away. Oh, okay. So we found two mod boxes. Wait, I need to take that. Install the mod on your weapon. An AR butt. <laughs> butt. That's not a butt. That's a weird hat at an angle. Oh, so you can mod weapons? That's sweet. How do I install it? Oh. So we can do a sight, a muzzle, magazine, and the butt. Increases reload time. Ah, oh, it's forever. But it does... Headshot damage? I mean, I can't really... I can't really aim. <laughs> You're all about pixel games? Yeah, me too. I, I do appreciate when they uh, are good and detailed. Like, the detail on her hand and stuff like that, like, th this is cool. I, I appreciate when devs do that. I think that's what makes games like Stardew and whatnot challenging. Uh, charming, I should say. Installing weapon mods. Each weapon has four types of mods. To install a mod, open your tablet tab, go to the equipment page, and select a weapon and press space. Well, let's pop another one. No.
An AR sight. Oh, damn. Uh, do you have any package for a game you played? Like, if you want to do a game, you played any discount for it. Oh, um, I don't... For this particular game, I, I don't... Like, I don't have a discount code, nor do I make any money off the sales or anything for this one. They're just basically paying me to play it. To which it's like, I'm glad they did, because I took a peek at this one and kind of forgot about it. And I'm glad that I'm actually playing it again, because... Sometimes with these early access games, there's so many... There's like... You have your alpha, your beta, your early access, your demo, your prologue, and it's like you could play a game nine times before it actually comes out. This is still early access at this point, but honestly, I'd be down to even play this one again when it's like fully released. Um, I'm not sure if like the full story is here, and that early access means that they're adding more. They could add, be adding anything from like side quests to more guns to anything. I'm not sure. So, quick question: Do you buy these games? in your own volition or the devs asking you to play more? Well, in this case, I'm being paid to play it. This is a sponsored stream. But, um, oftentimes I'm offered keys early before a game comes out and mm, maybe about 15 to 20% of the time I buy just a game on my own. So, like, later today we'll play some games and the two other games t later today I, I'm pretty sure I bought them on my own. So... But yep, yeah, anytime we have a sponsored stream, I say so at the start of the stream, and then it's in the description, too. Alright, let's install that uh, site. Critical damage multiplier, recoil per shot. Oh, damn. Oh, that's not a site at all. That's actually a laser. Okay. I was expecting it just to not really provide anything other than just extra damage. Oh, we got the flax ready. I think we're going to have to fight this dude eventually. He's going to tell on us. Alright, we have cabbage seeds again. Let's grow those. I'm not sure what that stuff gives us. Like, does it just... Like, what does it do? Like, is it for these people to eat, or what? Alright, so the armory still requires scrap metal. We can build a factory with three stone. Allows you to convert ore into ingots. Ship workshop allows you to acquire skyship components, cannons, and ship upgrades. So that's how we're going to modify our ship. And then the bar. Here you can drink and get a temporary boost. Alright. So we can go out, we can drink and then go out on a mission. Oh, there's a shop. What? Hey. Hello. Why did you suddenly have voice acting, Lucas? Are they working on voice acting? Maybe that's it. How can I help you? I'd like to buy something. Oh, he also sells seeds. Cotton and cabbage. Well, that's cool and all, but the guy down here... Is it the same price? It's the same price. Maybe when we have more um, buildings up, that guy will sell more stuff. What's up, bro? I'm back. I brought your rocks, although I don't understand what's so remarkable about them. They aren't rocks, girl. Data crystals carry information, and energy crystals are artificial storage devices. They're both shining examples of an ancient civilization technological progress. Some sources say people even used to fly among the stars. Sounds like a fantasy. Elsie loves those. Story or not, one day they will help me get back um, uh, in my own body, but right now, let's see how we can suit them to your needs. Okay. I can equip... Wait, I already have that equipped. Oh, okay, so I can install, like, a better hold. Better, like, nose cannon. Side guns. Faster sails. Oh, so we can go faster. 
Ship power. Better fuel. Better hull. Nice. Is this with, with support DLC? Um, this game's early access, so I'm not sure if it actually has uh, DLC or anything yet. I, I would imagine not. Do you have another mission for me? Find Iris on Big Water Island. Find scrap metal. I guess we completed that. Okay. Well, let's go to Big Water Island then. Maybe eventually. Oh, here. This is what the crystals do. Pyro station, power shield, shock st swarm, oppressor, Jericho. Oh, damn. Ron's knowledge level. How do I get that up? Pyro station. Automatic flamethrower turret. Can rotate 360 and burn enemies all around it. Do not use to cook hot dogs. Damage 2, duration 6. I think I'm going to hold on to these crystals. Spend crystals to raise Ron's knowledge level. Oh, it's prerequisite. Okay. So we got to find two crystals, then two more. Okay. Alright, well, let's try the pyro station then. Technology upgraded. Go to equipment tab on your tablet to activate. Oh yeah, now he's level 2. I guess it's already activated. How do I use it, though? The more I learn, the more I realize just how great the ancient civilization was. Dreaming about the past is a waste of time. What disrespectful regard for history. We can't understand the present without knowledge of the past, girl. I don't know how you can remember so many facts, but keep forgetting one simple name. My name is Eva, not girl. Hmm. My apologies. I'll write it in my notes, girl. Oh, it's Q. Okay. Alright, uh, let's see. Do you have another quest for me? I wish you'd tell me to go get more crystals. But later on, I guess. Alright, let's go to Wing Island. And we still gotta be on the lookout for scrap. Although this allows us to do a lot more side stuff, which is cool. Wait, that's a damaged ship there. Cynthia, help me fix my ship, please. The tornado put huge holes in the hull, and the ship is barely staying afloat. You have to try really hard to run into a tornado in Aspia, or have a really wild imagination. What are you trying to say? Listen, I need help. I promise you I'll pay for your work. Uh, okay. All finished. Next time you see a tornado, keep your distance. A what? All right, a tornado. Hey, if anyone asks about me, so you didn't see anything, okay? Why should I lie? Because you don't need problems. Here's your reward. Gotta go. Oh, she gave me a mod. Oh, hell yeah. Let's go back to the... Back to the island. What's up, Ryan? How you doing? Well, let's pop this other mod and see what we got. Hopefully it's something for the handgun. Handgun's good because it's got extra ammo. Uh, unlimited ammo. But its reload is a little slow. What's up, Clint? Good to see you as well. Oh, hell yeah. Magazine now? Damn.
Swap time. Capacity plus four. Swarm damage multiplier. Eh, it's okay, I guess. Sweet. Oh, we still don't have a maximum capacity, though. You just bought the full version of the game? Awesome, dude. Congratulations. I hope you enjoy. Yeah, it seems fun. Like, it's got elements of, like, Wind Waker to it. Or, like, um, Raft or Stranded Deep where you, like, go into islands to, like, clear enemies and stuff. I don't think we get to build anything there, but I, I would like to see that in the future. There's a lot of potential for even more coolness that way. All right. Oh, it's Big Water Island. We're going to Big Water. Is this game available for, available for PS4? I, I didn't see any of that in my notes, so they must be working on it. Is that a giant turtle? Wow, dude. Oh, that's what the arrows are. They're like wind streams. They're like highways. Okay. So these are like fast ways to travel. They're wind currents. Okay, I thought this was where we could move the big boat. Aw, oh, that's cool, dude. We're on a highway. That looks like a big-o enemy ship. Stay away from that. Oh, oh, oh boy. We could have died. Oh, damn, there's stuff in the rocks. Ah, oh, that must be where we get ore from then for the smelters. Cool. Alright. I'm liking this more and more, dude. I wonder if there's a way to get that ore without shooting it. Like if there's a more effective drill that'll give us more ore per shot or something. Dude, there's a giant flying turtle. Which kind of scares me, because that means there, if there's a big old turtle, that means there could be a big old predator that's going to eat it. Try to eat it. Sir, can you leave me alone? You love the islands in the sky? Me too. This game's pretty, man. This is the type of game where I'd like a beautiful screenshot to put on the wall. I love isometric games, like isometric arts styles, like Roller Coaster Tycoon and Parkitect and stuff like that, and I also love these pixel games too. Like if this um, was a game that was out on like Sega Genesis or uh, like Super Nintendo would have blown our minds and some of you were mentioning that it kind of like reminded you of Chrono Trigger or something it's like yeah channeling all those good games get wrecked sir I wonder if with this laser they can see me coming now. Copper ore.
There's a dig spot under the shed. Okay, we'll check it. Oh, cool. Thanks, shit. Rudolph Note 3. Council of Espai refused to share the territory of Espai with the Espian wolves. They've asked us to leave our islands by the end of the week. I don't know what we will do now. Hector said he will announce his decision tomorrow. This island looks complicated. Wait. What, what, what the hell? Whoa, what was that? What? When I try to heal on the edge of an island, it teleports me back to the ship. That's weird, but if I heal here... Uh... Oh wait, I'm pressing Charlie. Oh, the, the moth can like bring you back to the boat? What? Oh, I thought it was like glitching out or something. That's cool. Seems I need dynamite or some kind of explosive to clear the rubble. That was cool. Alright, so we need TNT to get through to there. Open the gate. Hi. Random guy. pretty lit. Oh, it won't let me go up the stairs. Oh, you can actually see where all the enemies are. Cool. that battery. Dude, the gun's super powerful now. Oh, they can get hit by their own ammo? Yeah, well, I guess when they fire a rocket like that, yeah. Huh. 
Okay, we need two for the door. Boom. Boss battle. Oh, I thought that was a <laughs> that was her hair. I thought it was a moth. I'm sorry, ma'am. I didn't I didn't know. Wow, those are some spiky shoulder pads. Uh, you're the one that killed my boys. Iris is about to teach you some manners. Iris, why are you a falcon in a falcon uniform? Do I know you? Uh, you must have been sent by my father. He didn't tell you, sneaky old man. He thinks of me as a useless child. He just had to dig me around in the dirt all day to feed those stinking moths. Now with the falcons, I'm a real adult now. I built a ship on my own. You want to be a beast just because of that? Let's talk to your dad. I tried talking to him many times. It's no use. Oh, we're going to fight. The arena's too big. Falcon, see my potential. I learned a lot of things. Well, let me show you. Okay, ma'am. Well, welcome to die. Ma'am? Right, I'm gonna be looting then. The gun range is so short. The ammo, my gun range is just way too short.
I'm gonna get her, boys. Oh, my handgun range is too short. Got her ass. First try! <laughs> Iris, stop. It doesn't have to end like this. You're so strong. I don't know what to do, Eva. I'm lost. Well, give me your gun with unlimited ammo. That'd be a good start. Iris, everything will be fine. You still have to find your way. After Mother's death, Dad can only see me as a child. You need to find your way yourself. You're still young, but you don't have to become a monster to earn respect. I hope you're making the right choice. Thank you, Eva. Tell my father I'm not going back. Not yet, anyway. I need some time. You're very capable and very brave, Iris. I'm sure the next time we meet will be in different circumstances. Ooh, she might be an ally now. Hold on, though. No. Alright, just had to finish her off. Alright, cool. Let's uh, go get some health. Cheating. She was cheating. What's up, Ghost and Snips? How you doing? Uh, I don't think there's any way across this water. Return to Morgan, but there's more to explore. Mod boxes are in there, but we need TNT. Dude. Now that I know you can hold Charlie and just the moth will teleport you back to the ship, that's just super helpful. Like, min minimizes backtracking. Oh, low fuel. Low fuel. If only you had an explosive arrow barrel. Oh, maybe an explosive barrel would work on that. You might be right, actually. 
We do have explosive arrow barrels back at the base. I don't know if that's what they're looking for, but we'll see. Oh, what is this? Oh, I see. We gotta figure out which one's lightest to heaviest, maybe? Okay, this one's heavier than circle. This one's heavier than X. And this one's heavier than X. Wait. Triangle, square. Yep. Unless it's heaviest to lightest. X is heavier than circle. So circle is definitely the lightest. Oh, square is heavier. I don't know if that's the order, though. There might be... I think I'll just reverse. Maybe it's lightest to heaviest, I don't know. Let's try it the other way around. I forgot already. Yay! Okay, so these are all for Ron. Every one of these are Rupert or whatever his name is. So anytime there's these like mechanical puzzles, it goes to him. So it was heaviest to lightest. So triangle, square, X, circle. Probably changes every playthrough, so. But at least we know. Uh, let's go. Looks like there might be a dock below us. Bom -bom. No, chat's fine with the backseat. It's fine. It was relevant and helpful. We worked together. Good job, chat. What is this? Oh, it's another big old gate. I'm not going in there. Oh, there's an explosive barrel. Just don't blow it up. Oh, I tanked a shotgun to the face. No, the TNT exploded. There's gotta be more around.
That guy's got a shield. This reminds me a little bit of uh, Hotline Miami now. I'm sad. That explosive barrel got explosive. Oh, there we go. Alright, good. We got another one. Ore back where the boss was killed? Is there? Uh, I think it actually... It does seem to mark the ore on the map, too. Does... Does the darker color mean we found it? I don't think we found that one. Good eyes, chat. Good eyes. Let's get this ore down here. <laughs> Copper seems to be kind of rare. Uh, then Kane, I did separate, 
uh, the earth from the heavens, and he did draw an invisible line saying, this land shall be known as a spy, and it shall be a steed? Don't you mean state? Clever clogs? Yeah, at this point, the combat's really starting to remind me of, like, Hotline Miami. A little bit. And that's a good thing. Falcon Bandit. Then Crash sunk his fangs into him and sucked out the bone marrow with his teeth. Oh, no way. How can teeth suck out bone marrow? Do you want to ask Crash what his teeth can do? No? go up between where those guys are guarding to get up there. On the other side of the waterfall. Cool. Money. Rudolph, note four, 13th of March. Tomorrow we move to some rocky island where, according to Hector, they won't find us. He says it's a temporary solution. It seems like we're now exiles. Ooh. Oh, well, there's the Wolf Clan. Marker, so we're where the Wolf Clan was. Cool. No, oh, d oh damn it. I hit... I teleported rather than healed. Noob. Oh well, let's just go to the uh, explosives. I think actually I can I can just fly there because that was like right here where that door was. I can just fly in there. Actually, right right here. Oh yeah, I can just fly to where I was. Right, let's go blow open the door though. I've been wanting to do that. How many crystals did we get, by the way? Three. Okay. I need to set off a barrel here.
More weapons mods. The only thing we don't have is a muzzle mod, so I think it'll be in there. So let's take an explosive barrel. Yeah. Oh, there's another one. Oh, if only we got the two barrels from that southern section. Although... Why can't I just jump in from here? Alright, there we go. We didn't need the, uh... Didn't need that after all. Did I update my gloves? Uh, no. Actually... Looks like we can upgrade our, like... Like a vest, shoes, and maybe a helmet? Or may oh, actually, that looks like a holster. Maybe it helps us carry more guns or something. Alright, if we find more TNT, we should probably keep some on the boat. That's going to be pretty useful. Oh, yeah, there's TNT there. Just laying next to it. Wow. Chad is observant. Good work, people. Alright, so we need to get to this left side. Oh, actually, we could just fly over here and then just jump across. Looks like there's another puzzle area. Dude, when we liberate this island, it's going to be huge. It looks like a big mining island. Alright, let's go to the west side of the island. Nope. I wonder how we go fishing. Where do we get a fishing pole? We're going to have to probably find one. Or it'll be a story-related thing. Okay, sir. Thank you. That'll buff out. Luckily, repair kits are pretty cheap. What's up, Shelly? What's up, DJ? Welcome to the stream, guys. Happy New Year's. Thanks for all the support. Thanks for watching. Thanks for all the member bombs. All the subs. Cool to have you here. Oh, storage full, okay. Oh ho ho. They won't let you like stick it on the deck of the uh, of the boat. Okay. 
Let's see, what can we get rid of? Eh, pretty much nothing. This is all useful. Eh, we'll just stack it up here. Pick it up later. Need to figure out how to get up there. I thought we could just fly, but there's got to be another way. walk through here. I was asked to put a lock on the crystals, but what combination should I use? Maybe I should try counting the neighbors? There are twice as many people living on the second island than there are on the first island. The same number of people live on the first island and the third island. There are two people living on the third island. Twice as many people living on the second island than there are on the first, so zero. Same number of people live on the first island and on the third island. Oh. And it's just doubled. So, two, two, four. That door, near, <laughs> that door nearly killed me. Oh, hi. Oh, thank God it stacks. Otherwise, I would have had to have left it. Chat got 242 as well. Good job, chat. First, I thought it was 020. Uh, yeah, 020. But I didn't realize it was the third island. So there's only like, there's only like four people living on the island? Where is the, uh, where are those guys at? Should be guys down here. We gotta clear out this island. Hey, fellas, there you are. Wow, we have 2,000 coins now.
Cool. Return to Captain Morgan, yeah. We had to tell him about his daughter. Looks like there's one more enemy, like, over there by the lighthouse. Uh, Morgan was the guy on that other island who uh, wanted us to go find Iris, his daughter. And then we f we fought her. That was like the the boss battle. I guess we just teleport back to the ship, I suppose. Wait a minute. Yeah, we've been here before. <laughs> Treasure by the gate. Treasure by the gate. Okay. This gate? Chat, was there an X somewhere near the, the big O gate that we opened? I'm looking for it, but I didn't, uh... Near the upper gate. South from the gate and then right. Oh, there. Oh, there. There. Gotcha. Wow, Chad. Wow. Nicely done. Damn. Those are easy to miss, man. Rudolph Note 5. We've landed in our new home. It really isn't easy to find. There is impassable cliffs all around. Surprisingly, quite a number of the Espion wolves chose not to follow Hector. Uh, now they're either historians or earners. In other words, traders. Never mind, we'll get by without them. Alright, let's go back to the boat. Nicely done, Chad. Wow. Yeah, those are not easy to find. Alright, apparently there's an enemy down here. Oh, it's the turret. Oh, damn, that shield does damage. Nice, so we can just pull up and blast them. Oh, hi there. Hey, hey. Hey, my do. Myron. Whale innards. I was about to start tossing messages in bottles onto the air just to 
get someone's attention. I'm almost out of fuel. Yeah, you won't get very far without fuel. Did you happen... Did something happen to your tank? Uh, the Falcons happened. I barely got away. The jerks decided they were above the law and attacked, and now I'm late for my daughter's party because of them. Can you help me? Uh, sure. Let me grab some fuel. I don't know how much you need, but... You need a full fill-up? Okay. Do I like silly adventure games? Uh, yeah, I do. Toe Jam and Earl is a good one. Ratchet and Clank? Oh my god. Love that. You know, you remind me of my daughter. You're both so active. Thanks. Here, take this gift from me. Glad to help. No girl should have to miss their father, especially on their birthday. Oh, damn. Another, uh... Mod. I want to clear this island, then go home and see what we got. We still haven't been able to find scrap parts. I shouldn't have spent them on the hole at the start. I think the devs should, um... Maybe for that part, just make it so that way... When you try to spend those scrap on anything, just say, talk to so-and-so first. You know, just for for dumb brains like me. Did I get scrap metal from him? Did I? We got scrap metal from a pirate ship, did we? Repair kits, ship ammo. Oh, we did. We got one. Hey, we got it, chat. All right. <laughs> cool. I don't think I have to destroy these. No, we can't. Oh, where's the last enemy? We're so close to securing the uh, the island. Alright, so scrap must be uh, gathered from um, pirate ships too, which is cool. So the pirate battles are really nice. Then that way, you can get tons of scrap, which means you can build armories and more farms. I don't know where we're going to find enemies. There's a skull there. And there. Those must be the enemies. Rude, sir. Rude. Yeah, there's somebody out there. Alright, there's a turret over there. Maybe that's what they are, just turrets. You know, honestly, this is a pretty big island. The only one bigger than that is, like, the whatever one is over here. At least it looks like it. Could be. Maybe that only worked because I uh, blew up a missile when he was shooting it. Hmm. 
Where else could there be enemies? What's your favorite shooter? Uh, McGavin. Oh, stuff respawns. Look, you, you could farm for money a little bit. Tell me I can't secure this because the battleship's there. That's going to be a no. What's your favorite shooter shooter game, I should say? Well, I said McGavin, which is funny, but uh, I think... Um, Honestly, I don't know. You know, they actually, before first-person shooters were a thing, they used to call shooter games like, um, I think it was like Gladius and stuff. A lot of those, um, a lot of those games where it was like a, a left-to-right airplane shooter, a spaceship shooter, th they called those shooters. But I can remember one for the, uh, Sega Master System that was a big pain in the ass. I forget the name of it, though. Um, I think it was just called Interceptor or something. Oh, yeah, like Galaga, yeah. Yeah, Fortnite. Oh, man, I don't want to leave this island because I feel like we're close to killing everybody here. Uh, there's some ore we can't get and wood. Alright, I guess we'll just have to come back because, well, now the pirate ship's gone. There's got to be, like, one guy somewhere. I don't know. Let's go back to Morgan, and then let's go back home. And then we'll just... We'll come back here. I guess. Also, we can fast travel, so that's easy. What's up, Shelly? You had Warcraft 2 on PlayStation 1? No way. Was that on PlayStation 1? No way. I believe you, though. Because I had uh, Command & Conquer Retail... Uh, it was called Command & Conquer Red Alert Retaliation. Goat Sim or Deer Sim? No. Oh, wait, there's a... There's a mod box up there. Oh, that's right. That's where the bird nest is. All right, where is this guy? There you are. So, we talked to your daughter. Eva, did you find her? What happened to my daughter? Iris isn't coming back, Morgan. Not yet. Your daughter's very capable. She wasn't taken by the Falcon. She ran away to join them, away from you. She's growing up and trying to find herself, and you just get in her way. After my wife's death, it was as if time stood still for me. Oh, my little girl, she's already grown up. I'm an old fool. Sooner or later, she'll come home, but for now, she needs freedom and time. I need to think about all this, but in any case, thank you for your help, Eva. Can you hear? That's her familiar noise. Oh, no. Damn, Falcons. Morgan, hide. Boss battle.
That's not a good sound. No. Uh, if you're in danger of dying, Luma will carry you to your sky ship, spending one Luma energy in the process. In this case, Luma's energy run out. She'll take you to the bed where you last slept. Energy recovery. After death, Luma takes you to your ship when spending one energy. I'm not dead. I'm not dead yet. Let's go. Give me my ammo back. Let's go. I wasn't expecting a fight. There we go. Alright, cool. So it's not that you die. It's like you, you get knocked down. But you get up again. I guess you only die when you have to go back to bed. Oh, Morgan's dead. No! Morgan, damn. I didn't notice they were following me as I sailed here. It's my fault. I'll call for help. Hang in there. Eva, please look out for Irish. She needs something of her life. She's calling me. I was a terrible father. Forgive me. You weren't terrible, bro. You cared for her. You sent me out on a mission to save her. You cared. Healing took a little too long. Oh wait, there's a mod box and a green thing. Maybe yeah, that means quest complete or something. Rips in the chat, boys. Alright, now we can go back and build the armory. Cool. Propeller the house. Ship part? What? Did it just not give it to me? Oh, he actually rewarded me? Oh, he became a propeller? Oh. <laughs> okay. Alright then. Added to shipyard. Alright, cool. Now we can upgrade. Well, we won't be able to use that until, uh,. We won't be able to use that until we get that one upgrade. Damn, chat, you're really observant. I I find it easy to miss things in this game. I'll have to... Oh, well, that's why you're here. I'm used to things blinking. Like the money. Alright, let's RTB. Wait. Can I just fast travel? Eh, let's just fast travel. Travel to the fro. What? That's the father ship, not a fuel station. That's a fuel station. This is a shipyard. Whatever. All right, let's offload the ship then. Asteroid coal. Sounds like a blue singer. Oh, there's a tier two mod box too. Okay. so it's easier to find. Another butt. Another sight.
a barrel, and okay, and it's another site. Okay, that's cool that there's multiple sites. They must give different bonuses then on whatever enemy you're fighting. Headshot damage multiplier. Oh, that one seems good. Yep. That brings our equipment power up to 176. Okay. 192. These are the same. Eh, we'll go with that one. Can't modify the handgun yet, though. That shucks. Legion, thanks for becoming a Raptor Plus member again. Welcome back. Thank you very much for the support. New member, welcome. Yeah. All right, let's go chat with the... Uh, oh, Cabbage is ready. Let's buy cotton this time. All right. Uh, let's build an armory. Build an armory, yep. Let's build that there. Allows you to acquire equipment, weapons, mods, and player upgrades. Cool. Wow, we were, we were playing the whole game without all these extra upgrades and stuff, so we were like playing at a disadvantage. But that was a good challenge. Like, I wasn't too terribly difficult. The power of equipment and the power of the ship are important indicators of player's power. Overall power of the equipment can be increased by armor, belt, bag, boots, weapons, weapons, mods, artifacts, and grenades. Oh! Total power of the equipment is the sum of these items displayed at the top of the tablet. Oh, damn, I get a sniper rifle now? Oh, I need an iron ingot, though. So now we gotta build, like, a smeltery. But we can buy a shotgun, brother. Hell yeah. Oh, we can also make our own weapon mods, too. Or upgrade. Flashlight? Backstab? Luma energy? Oh, this is cool. So we need cotton, scrap metal... Alright, so scrap metal is going to be the biggest factor in this game. So we got to go off and fight a bunch of pirates and whatnot to be able to build the factory then from iron ingots and stuff. We saw that when we looked at the menu earlier. Right here. So we just need three stone. So never mind. But still, we'll need scrap to make the stuff in the, uh, in the menus. Well, let's buy a shotgun just for fun. Player's upgrades can be found in the armory terminal. When you activate an upgrade, you mobilize a population. You can deactivate an upgrade, and then the mobilized population will be demobilized again, and you can choose another upgrade. To have more population, liberate more islands by destroying all the enemies on them. Oh. Apply the backstab upgrade in the armory. Oh, okay. That's cool. So it's based on the, lo uh, the number of people that you've uh, liberated. Yeah, two primary weapons and a secondary, yeah. Or the, the handgun. Which I'm not sure if we can get a better gun than that, but we might be able to modify the handgun. Sister Fly, quick to the Big Water Island. The situation on, with the Falcons is getting worse and worse. Looks like they've found my hiding place. Damn. Looks like Aaron's in a bad way. I must fly to help him quick. Oh, we were already there. Population lost. Liberated islands can come under attack. If you're unable to defend them, your population will fall and some of your upgrades will be deactivated if the demobilized population is insufficient. Oh, interesting. So they'll try to take their territory back. So you might have to go and defend on occasion. Right now we've got like 17, though. But now we have to go to Big Water again anyway, so that's exactly what we just did. But we came back for upgrades, so that's cool. Let's test out the shotgun. Horrible. Uh, hi. Hi. 
That's a really bad range. That's not good at all. I would only use that if there's like... Like a boss battle. And he's like reloading. Yeah, so we can upgrade our, our little... Like we can upgrade the little... What is it called? The sky ship? We can upgrade our big ship here like we were repairing the floor and stuff earlier. So as we get more and more scrap, we'll probably spend that. But now we know it's more useful for the buildings for the time being. But, I mean, you know, it seems like you want to upgrade and fix your ship, too. Make that all better. I wonder if we can make a change to this without a shipyard. Ship durability increase and acceleration increase. And a little bit of handling. And a little less fuel consumption. It's okay. You can only change skyships and components in shipyard. Uh, do we have to build one? Oh, you can make upgrades and stuff there. Yeah, it looks like uh, for defending the islands, we were given a turret earlier. Like, there's little turrets here on our ship. But we found a turret that we were able to collect earlier, so we might be able to put it on one of the friendly islands, and that'll help to defend. That'd be kind of cool. Oh, let's talk to what's-his-name. Uh, give me the power shield. And Ron needs more knowledge. Oh, we can upgrade the levels. Oh. So we need to get Ron to level 3. So we got to, like, upgrade these two again. Or the power shield twice. Upgrading that will give it from 6 to 8. Well, let's do it. Then we just need to upgrade Shockstorm a little bit. So let's do... Um, let's do... Uh, where did I change that upgrade? Heard strange noises coming from the lab. Did Rupert knock over the tool shelves? Yes, Rupert's quite clumsy. I know worse than an elephant <laughs> seal in a porcelain shop, but what would you expect from an ape? Have you tried training him? He's learned how to dress himself and button and his buttons. Don't expect the impossible from the poor fellow. Um How do I change that? Oh there. Oh, damn, that lasts a long time. Oh, that's going to be a great upgrade. Um, okay, so now we got the big old bronze propeller. Yep. Yep, cool. All right, so the next order of business is to go to Bronze Island. Bronze Island? Big Water Island. <laughs> I guess I called it Bronze Island because that's where all the money was. Alright, but we've already pretty much cleared it out, so when we swing by there, we're just gonna it's gonna be a quick trip, so that's that's good. And uh boy. Oh, some of these islands not recommended to go till Actually a lot of these we could go to. We're at five forty two out of five twenty, so we can go down to Hungry Gardens, White Fin. Broken stairs seems to be pretty easy. Uh, windy, windy river, Glutton Island, Sickle Arch Archipelago, Moth Nest. These seem to be all like ones we can go to pretty easily. Looks like there's some strong winds blocking us from going down here until we go up around. Nice. All right. 
Well, this is certainly the type of game I'd like to play again in the future. Uh, we're in this shipyard now. Yeah, we certainly are. If we're if we're at the ship, I guess we can make our changes to our ship here, and then well, we can also build them on the ship by building a, a little a little thingy. So that's good. All right, guys, I'd like to play this game again in the future. If you think you'd want to see more of this one, make sure you go ahead and uh, click or tap that like button and also uh, subscribe for more. I think we're going to come back and play this one on our own in a non-sponsored stream. This stream was sponsored. The link is down below in the description if you'd like to uh, pick up Black Skylands today. But this was so fun. I think we'll continue on with it sometime in the future. Uh, I appreciate the whole, like, you know, exploring islands and the combat and stuff. A lot of it's fun without being tedious or whatnot. And uh, there's a lot of things to, like, see on the screen. So I'd appreciate your guys' help in finding more X's mark the spots. You know, we're on a little pirate adventure together. So it seems like a pretty damn fun game for sure. Wow, they don't even want us to go down there until we get a 1,000 on our combat rating. That's going to be a big fight down there, whatever that is. The swarm's getting closer. And there's lots of little islands to discover. What a good little early access game, man. Much, 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 much more to this game than I was expecting. And, of course... Uh, my first look on the uh, channel is available, too, if you want to see what the game looked like a couple of uh, maybe months ago. But anyway, thank you very much for watching, guys. I'll be back in a little bit with the next Big O live stream. So thank you very much for watching, and uh, hope to see you again soon. Thank you very much, everybody, for being here. We'll be back with more Black Skylands sometime in the future. I'm going to make sure I save. Cool. All right, I'll see you guys in the next Big O stream. Let's go.